<sighs> Poor Cheryl. She's decomposing, sir. <laughs> sweets i hope you are doing fantastic this week doing really well um <laughs> you know i don't even know why i bother making a schedule because <laughs> every week the universe is like nah i'll have to put that aside girl <laughs> you know we got our own plans um so it's another week to adapt i am not doing the movie that i plan to do but i'm doing a movie i'm really <laughs> excited to watch this week's movie y'all is the long awaited i'm a little scared <laughs> Evil Dead. <laughs> so this is part of a series, a series that I actually was gonna wait a couple more weeks to start. I believe there is a new one coming out, which must be why there is a lot of renewed interest in bringing this title up for the channel, which love it, it's great. Uh, obviously I'm not gonna be caught up in time to like watch this new one, but I'm gonna go ahead and start dipping a toe, okay? We've got a lot of series going on, but we always have room for one more. Uh, this first one came out in 1981, I wanna say. The main reason actually that I have been excited to watch this movie has very little to do with this movie itself. Like y'all say this movie is good, so I'm very excited to see it. But the main reason I'm excited to see it is because I really wanna watch Cabin in the Woods. But y'all told me that it's sort of referential toward Evil Dead. So I didn't wanna miss references. So I haven't watched Cabin in the Woods because I was waiting until after I saw Evil Dead, but now, <laughs> y'all since we are jumping into this one we are soon gonna jump into that one best believe also it's one more week till scream y'all <laughs> but that's a different video um yeah i don't know anything about this movie so let's see what it gives <laughs> got my little fader Ooh. oh no intro no nothing we're just beginning misty screen sound of flies okay Um, first of all, let me open this alcohol because I'm already a little unnerved. It's got this like very 80s guerrilla filmmaking quality. That's super creepy. Is it a beast? Y'all sure are skirt skirting on this mountainside. Look, here comes a truck. Yeah. Look at the road, sir. This Texas Chainsaw Massacre truck is coming straight for you. Here. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> what the hell was that? Are you trying to kill us? Hey, don't blame me. Just steering wheel. It jerked right out of my hand. No, no. You need to be paying attention to the road because y'all barely made it by the skin on your chinny chin chins. Hey, Scotty, what's this place like anyway? The guy that's writing it says it's an old place. A little run down, and the best part is we get it so cheap. Why are we getting it so cheap? Haunted. I don't know. Might be in real bad shape. Nobody's seen this place yet? Well, it might not be that bad. Occupied no. by the devil, I'm sure. Nice. <laughs> and I think this is where we get off. Dangerous bridge. Travel at own risk. Jesus Christ, the whole thing's falling apart. Oh, uh-uh. Thing as solid as a rock. It literally <laughs> said... Dumb. Dumb, dumb, dumb as a bowl of mayonnaise. Why are you doing this? Now, how do you plan to get back? <laughs> Gorgeous last view though. Take it in, folks. It's very pretty. Oh, goodness, not even a road. You are driving through forest. <laughs> Good luck. You're literally dragging limbs behind this car. It is so ill-equipped for the terrain. It's a shack. <laughs> Just you by your lonesome, you're gonna go check it out. <laughs> First and foremost, stop that swing. <laughs> you to die. Ugh. Dusty as the crypts where your bodies will lay. <laughs> Very upsetting. <laughs> oh look, chains hanging from the ceiling. Bones and such. Bric-a-brac. It's looking very Texas chainsaw. There's the saw. It just doesn't have a chain on it. You're gonna be manually cut apart. Look at that. What is that? Like a machete? 
Yeah, what do you think this kill shed is for? Mm. Okay. <laughs> Should've wore a thicker sweater. <laughs> I'm cold. You're gonna die. Okay, though. She is serving face. The Phantom is an artist. Oh, cubism. Why aren't you screaming for help? Oh. Girl, you ain't gonna mention it? Uh, I would like very much to make a toast here for I just don't understand that. <laughs> I don't understand. Even if you didn't think it was a phantom, wouldn't you be like, I had a mild stroke or something, some kind of seizure, like I lost control of my body. Y'all should probably know unless I fall out, just in case. I could drop at any moment. I don't know what's going on with me. Look it. None of our business. Let's leave. Let's just close it up. It's probably just some animal. Girl, you've already been captured by something. <laughs> Grip your pencil for dear life. There's something down there. Are we just gonna ponder it POV instead of getting in the car and leaving? Probably just some animal. Here, sure. Why don't you go down and check, and make sure. Scotty, I'm not going down there. Cowards, I'll go. Bye, Scotty. Back in a minute. <laughs> Will you though? <laughs> Will you be? <laughs> If this is a joke, fuck you for real. If you're dead, R.I.P. Got it. He's just kidding around. Is he a kidder? Let me give me a flashlight. Mm-mm. Well, you're gonna go? Up. Then get the ladder. How deep can it be? Why can't y'all see a thing? Oh, it's like that. Nah. <laughs> I would have to be like, fuck Scotty, I'm sorry. No, because where could he be down here? What could he be doing? Scotty? The fact he's not answering at this point, at least go up and get a weapon before you start to investigate. I know this young Jay Leno looking motherfucker ain't gonna walk into this closet and open it not knowing what in the good goddamn hell is going on. People are shocking. <laughs> What's hanging from the ceiling? Gourds? What is that? Travel from weird cavern to weird cavern empty handed. <laughs> I literally. I would kill. <laughs> I would kill him and leave him down there. A gun? Is that a Hills Have Eyes poster? Take your ass upstairs. I bet this still shoots. Probably Why would you point that at him? <laughs> Scotty, you play too fucking much. When you die, it'll be your own fault. I will not shed a tear. Ew. Oh God. I know you're not gonna open the spell book from Hocus Pocus like it's nothing. Oh my God. That is a drawing of the devil's ass. Satanic. Whew. You don't know nothing about that. You need to put it down. This kind of looks like your old girlfriend. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, let's take this stuff upstairs. Why would we do that? This oh. guy was a real turd. Okay, listen to this. This is a tape I found downstairs. It has been a number of years since I began excavating the ruins of Kandar. Now my wife and I have retreated to a small cabin. Here I continued my research on a volume of ancient Sumerian burial practices entitled Nacharan de Manto, roughly translated Book of the Dead. The book is bound in human flesh and inked in human blood. <laughs> is that hand holding doing enough for you? <laughs> I'd be like, bro. These enduring creatures may lie dormant, but are never truly dead. Uh. They may be recalled to active life through the incantation. 
limitations presented in this book. Oh. Possess the living. They're gonna take your body. Yeah, turn that shit off. Scotty, shut the fuck up. The, Scotty's gonna be the one to bloody Mary, bloody Mary, bloody Mary you to death. I just wanna hear the rest of it. No big deal. Oh, so you're gonna like actually allow the spell to play. <sighs> and the mists of the dead resurrecting the evil. <laughs> yeah, I mean, go ahead and get them. They asked for it. Start with Scotty. Girl, you're not wrong. <laughs> You're a dickhead, and y'all shouldn't have brought him. She acts like she's three years old or something. <sighs> Fuck him for real. Like, it's a joke to be scared? Fuck you, dum dum. <laughs> Why don't we stay up for a while and let's have a start? Alright, yeah. Let me check on Cheryl first. Thing. One good thing about this is that I hate y'all. Everybody except for Cheryl. The other two girls, I don't know about them yet. You might as well bury that key to your heart with the souls of the dead, because y'all ain't making it out this cabin. some kind of looking glass. I actually do think that's pretty. I really love it. I've never taken it off. Girl, I fear you will be buried with that looking glass. Mm. Look at the lurkers. He is so dumb. Who would give him ass? I'm just disgusted. <laughs> Poor Cheryl. Leave her alone. Girl, they trying to get you to link up with the cabal of Kandar. Not I. <laughs> Not Miss Cheryl Ann. <laughs> Girl, why would you investigate? That's not your brand. You don't want to go to the cellar. Is anybody out there? But you gonna go out to these join us woods? If you don't take them little flip bangs back in the house. Mm. I like the way that looks, but it's also very upsetting. <laughs> Why are you investigating, babe? You're not a liar. I heard you. Pack it up. What can you really do in a terry cloth robe? <laughs> Girl, just go inside. This is dangerous for a lot of reasons. A tree could fall on you. Hey, the vines are vining. What is what is this? Oh no, Ooh. Oh heavens, girl. Oh my God. Ah. Oh God, these vines are giving her the Freddy Krueger treatment. Like seriously, why is this going on for so long? What's happening? Why is she being stripped? Ooh. Why is that happening? Why is that happening? Okay, nope, wrap that up. I'm not gonna, I'm just gonna not look at that because y'all know that's the number one fucking thing I can't stand. I don't even see why you would write that scene. Why am I being made to see this? Ugh. End it now. Cheryl of all people, sweet Cheryl. Ugh. Why are these ones from the 80s and the 70s? They're the most fucked up. There's something about just like the crude darkness of it. I don't know. I, I just, ugh. This girl better live. I just, this is disgusting. Like, what is even chasing her? Just the spirit of evil? Oh, there's the house. Okay. Girl, do not give up now. You are right there. Imagine them not running out to see what the fuck is going on with you. Girl, go in the door. You came out. What the hell? I mean, I, she's in shock. What she's been through doesn't even make any fucking sense. How are they not hearing and coming to her aid? We're in the middle of fucking nowhere. Ugh. Honestly, they deserve to die for not even caring that their friend is out here screaming. Like, <laughs> what the hell? Oh, Cheryl. What is that? It took you long enough, bitch! Something in the woods did this to you? No, it was the woods themselves. No. What? Lie down for a minute. I want to leave this 
right now. I sure as hell am not leaving any place tonight. Then you can stay and die, you stupid ball of shit. I'm leaving. I hate that guy. I don't care how it sounds. I want to get out of this place right now. Like, look at her. Even if you don't think it was the woods. Like, this girl is traumatized as shit. Just get her out of there. Ash, you're growing on me. I appreciate you just hearing her and doing what she says. The three of you in the doorway can eat a d I'm so disgusted by your behavior. <laughs> oh, they fucked the car up. Oh, there's no escape. <laughs> Evans! <sighs> it's not gonna let us leave. My girl already clocked the tea. <laughs> oh, okay. The forest really said, I can't blow my cover yet. <laughs> And they're like, they're laughing and like kicking and going back in the house. Y'all deserve whatever the hell you get. I feel nothing for you. <laughs> I would have been scared to try to even go any distance in a car that would barely start. What's this? Why are you stopping? Wait here a minute. Why, why, why? We could barely get this bitch going. Excuse me, Ashton. Do you see something? Come back to the car, Ashford. Where are you going? Ash tree. Is he being like lured by those screeches like a siren to the rocks? Ashley? If I was Cheryl, no way in hell would I get out that car. <laughs> Take it back to the vehicle, babe. Ashwagandha made his choices. I can't do it. What, what, what are these ruins? <gasps> the bridge. The bridge has been annihilated. I regret to inform you, we are gonna die here. Oh! Why would you snatch me out the darkness like that? I know now that my wife has become host to a Kandarian demon. I fear that the only way to stop those possessed of the act of bodily dismemberment, whatever I have resurrected through this book, is sure to come calling for me. And it ought to get you. You had no business. <laughs> Playing cards knowing that there's no way for you to leave this place. Hey Ash, I guess the car Yeah, truly amazing. Girl. Some sort of extra sense of queen of spades. Two of spades, jack of diamonds, jack of clubs. Oh, there she goes, possessed. Y'all didn't want to believe her. Get to it, girl. I don't feel bad for them. Her eyes, bitch, she was levitating. <laughs> Ew, look at her. Disgusting. Ooh, who just got that pencil? <gasps> oh, gruesome. Okay, okay, we get it. Oh, oh, you didn't have to take that backhand. You should have listened to Cheryl the first time. <sighs> oh, y'all getting tossed around this cabin. It even rotted her teeth. Cheryl, stop it. <laughs> like, honestly, eat them up, demon. That's very unfortunate to me. I'm actually rooting for Cheryl in this situation. <laughs> that puppet that he's fighting is crazy. Funny of you to think that's enough. <laughs> Stupid ass. The only thing that's truly unfortunate is that she was the first to succumb when she didn't want nothing to do with this nonsense. How are you just sleeping? Ash, I think we ought to get out of here. Oh, do you? <laughs> you can rot, dummy. We'll get in the car. We'll take the bridge. And there's no bridge, didn't you tell them? Everybody's like slowly losing it. <laughs> oh, yucky. <sighs> Poor Cheryl. She's decomposing, sir. <laughs> Nothing is all right. Every, every, everything's going to be all right. We can't even find one thing that's all right. <laughs> Take Scotty. Get some sleep, okay? I don't appreciate these spirits picking off the women first. Very unfortunate. Um, Ash, you just sat there? 
didn't even open the door to see what the hell's going on in there. Why so calm? Where is this collectiveness coming from? You should be a heap on the floor, shivering, terrified, confused as shit. Oh, I have to sneeze. fingers <laughs> how could you have sex with a man who had fingernails like that whip <laughs> <gasps> him up Shelly eat his face where did this wig come from oh you threw Shelly's ass in the fire The other demon is like, oh, Shelly done tapped in. <laughs> Ash, you really spectated for a long time. <laughs> I don't blame you though. I would let Scotty's ass burn too. Burn him, burn him. <laughs> he sucks. This is literally all your fault. <laughs> yeah, stab him. <laughs> Sorry. Ew. These effects are crazy. I'm sorry, are you eating your own hand? You just nod your own hand off? Okay. Wait. <laughs> Ew. Are you just gonna stand there and let her ass screech? <laughs> Ash. Ew. What's that about? It's why is there white liquid coming out of her hand hole? That's disgusting. One thing about practical effects, you gonna wanna throw up. <laughs> I'm ill. So is she dead just cause they cut the hand off and stabbed her with that cursed blade? Oh no, nah, she was just playing with y'all. She said not for real, just for play play. <laughs> oh, I feel bad for Ash, she can't do it. He's too scared. Scotty is a punk bitch, so I know he wouldn't have no problem chopping his girlfriend up. I mean, I get that it's what you had to do, but you deserve to die. You should have just taken it. <laughs> she wouldn't be like that if it weren't for you. <laughs> you should have just let her eat you. Nasty. And all the parts are writhing. The sound effect is so beyond unnecessary. <laughs> we got a barrier now. And what? Just come down the mountain like she was never with y'all? He is a psychopath. <laughs> to tell the authorities nothing you're just gonna drag her chopped corpse into the woods and bury it right now in the dead of night and then move on with your lives sorry but ash is too sweet he can't hack that <laughs> he will never be able to get over this <laughs> mm. the fact that linda slept through that what's wrong with her <laughs> Linda cannot walk with a leg like that. Well, then we'll leave her here. I, I told we can send somebody back. He is such crazy? a punk ass bitch. Don't get out. Oh, wow. I don't care what happens to her. Ew. She's your girlfriend. You take care of her. Feed him to the demons. Now, now. Do not hesitate. Ash, I swear to God, if you don't sacrifice this bitch, I will crawl through the TV and do it myself. How dare he? How dare you bring this situation upon us and then leave us all for dead? <laughs> Mm. Cheryl, pipe down, baby. <laughs> Linda, get up. Scotty is ready to sacrifice your ass. Did they give her a bunch of painkillers? What? What's that? Oh, she's already been taken. Ew. Popped up like Chucky. <sighs> no! <laughs> Are you kidding? I don't care what happens to you. Isn't that the line we're using? <laughs> Kind of giving doll. <laughs> the rosy cheeks. You're gonna be just fine. No, he's gonna die and he should. <laughs> Linda, come eat this bitch. <laughs> Cheryl was right. Oh no, I'm gonna die here. I mean, oh. you're gonna die. Ash, you should try to live. I'm gonna die. Listen to me, please, for God's sake. It's already Stop. over for him. <laughs> yeah, slap him again. Ash, I don't wanna die. Well, you, you shouldn't have done this then. Are you? I don't want to die. 
I just feel no sympathy for him. I don't care how much he rides in pain and the demons cackle at his corpse. <laughs> Ash is getting agitated. Uh oh. He can't do it. And I couldn't do it either. She's not even being violent. Oh. Help me, please. Oh, she's just trying to lure you. She's going to bite you on the neck when you get close. <laughs> Ashley, help me. Huh? Let me out of here. All right now, Ashley. Don't fall for it too quick, Ash. Mm-mm. Where's your sense, Ashy? Don't unlock no locks. Sure. Let me see your demon-free face. <laughs> oh! Oh, damn! You're very strong, girl. <laughs> Ew, don't put your rotted thumb in the mouth. <laughs> That's <pretty. laughs> Oh, Linda was never not possessed. Where are you dragging her to? I mean, how far can you really take her and what for, babe? <laughs> he was like, just far enough to get her clear of my sight. <laughs> so all the girls are dead or possessed and Scotty's dumbass is getting spoon fed water. Oh, he's dead. <laughs> pouring water down his face. We'll all be going home together. Delusional. Fully lost it. <laughs> Clinging to a reality that does not exist. Yeah, he's dead, babe. <laughs> Getting dragged and slow down at all. She's licking the blade. Ew. The way she's licking it is what's truly insane. <laughs> Scott's corpse being knocked off the sofa is hilarious to me. <laughs> now, Linda. Listen, Linda, listen. <laughs> oh, damn, Cheryl. They're tag teaming you, Ash. She's gonna get that spine stab. Why are they spitting up milk like that, though? That's the part I truly do not understand. <laughs> Post it up! <laughs> you are funny, girl. <laughs> are you about to chop her? <gasps> oh, Ash. I'm sorry, but nothing could convince me to do this to the face of someone I loved. Like, do you plan to live in this cabin? If you don't just go. Uh, yeah. Either die trying to get away or die trying to get away because <laughs> you can't just live there with the chopped up corpses of your friends. And Cheryl cackling under the floorboards, waiting to snatch your ankle. <laughs> Are you gonna bury her? <laughs> Cheryl gonna put that strength to use. <laughs> you got a milk spitter that just woke up. Get that shovel ready, Ashy. <laughs> she said, it's your favorite game. Am I awake? <laughs> Am I awake? <laughs> yeah, go on and toss her in that hollow ground at least. Get out the hole, babe, before you're forced to join her. Too. Oh gosh, she's scratching the hell out of you. Linda, girl, please. Oh, oh god. Immobilized. And this Betty White wig will not go down. Spitting the milk. <laughs> Lord, Cackle Queen, give it a rest, girl. <laughs> Good Lord. Oh. Ew. Ew. The headless corpse is clawing at his face. Give it up. Why even go back in this cabin? Yeah, Cheryl's ass and popped out the hole. <laughs> I really like envision myself a survivor, but at this point, I might just lay down. I mean, honestly. Oh, there she go. <laughs> Ew. Blood is spurting. 
the wig is heinous. <laughs> Gnashed those swamp fingers and kept them out, but what now, babe? What now? <laughs> and none of those little how to awaken a demon tutorials. Did he tell you how to end this shit once and for all? Did he live? Ugh, why is this pipe gushing blood? And who wrapped that shirt around it? Was that Cheryl? I mean, yeah. You got carried for nothing. Because why would you just stand under that bloody pipe like that? Yuck. Uh oh. Shooting at you. <laughs> oh, the pipe is all out of blood. Yuck. You really could have stepped around that, honey. You wanna get trench foot from stepping in a bloody hole? Shutters are shaking, Ashy. What you gonna do? Oh, sick. <gasps> was it hot water? <laughs> or was that just too trippy for y'all? Good. I get it. Don't waste any more bullets, babe. He is so scared. This is sad. Torturing you, babe, everyone is dead. I'd say that they got it worse than you. <laughs> like, I mean, I guess their pain is over, whereas you are still being made to suffer. Everyone has succumbed to torture, and the only one who deserved it was Scotty. Ooh. These beasts from Thriller will not take no for an answer. Ooh. Goodness, the blood is always spurting. <laughs> God's trifling ass. Of all the chopping up I done chopped, I would not hesitate when it comes to this fool. <laughs> Come on, Ashy. You gotta kill him. Ew. Yuck, it is so thick. Ew, you're gonna pull his bone out? This is very nasty. <laughs> oh, can you burn the flesh book? Will that do it? Honestly, fuck that excavator of Kandar who even left that book in existence. After he done chopped his damn wife up, he could have burned that book at least. Pull a hereditary, throw that book in the fire. <laughs> Ugh, they are really eating you up. <laughs> Honey, how's that little looking glass supposed to be? Oh, he's biting your calf. Can your legs not kick? Like, why are you just letting yourself get dragged? Blue? Where did that come from? What's that about? I don't know why you're leaking antifreeze. The wig is falling away. Tress by tress. Ugh. This is impressive. Like, ugh, it's so disgusting. It's just so weird. Was, is, is that enough? <laughs> Did I do it? <laughs> Wash your face. Ew, why are grits oozing out of that wrist? <laughs> Cheryl, please succumb. <laughs> what? God. So those are the demons coming out of their corpses? <laughs> it just, it really just goes on and on. I don't even know how I'm gonna edit this. <laughs> he has taken so much guts to the eyeballs. He's gonna be blind. Ew, roaches? A snake? A little baby snake? And more disintegration. Please. I have made it clear I'm not looking to be recruited. Oh, you're just gonna lay there in the fluids? Okay, couldn't be me, but you have been through a lot, so I'm gonna let you have that. Is it daytime? That necklace, that poor necklace. Oh, Linda. <laughs> Beautiful sunrise. <laughs> Personally, I do not know how I would greet another day. <laughs> and he's just gonna hobble his way back to civilization.
So he, he got got? This is Sam Raimi? Oh, I didn't know that. I literally did not know that, y'all. Wow. That's why it's actually scary. <laughs> mm. Ew, gross. <laughs> that was so nasty. Uh, uh, this little soda shop tune they're playing is grotesque following what we just witnessed. <laughs> Damn, y'all. That was something. <laughs> It was so weird. It was very, very strange. It's funny because there was like very little in the way of plot. It was mostly just uh, fear, terror, and disgust. I still really enjoyed watching it though. <laughs> I'm interested to know if y'all think that the sequels are worth seeing. And if not, we will just skip to the new one when the new one is available. The effects were 12 out of 10 though. I have to say they did a really good job with those. Like that was crazy. The stuff they did with those practicals, I literally, like, I'm glad I didn't eat before watching that because I would have been sick. <laughs> Talk to me about Evil Dead, y'all. Next week. <laughs> you already know what it is. If you know, you know it's Scream. Don't tell me anything, please. Sorry, I'm still so scared of getting spoiled for this movie, y'all. I never get on social media because I'm so scared of being spoiled for Scream. But I only have a few more days to wait. <laughs> watch it i'm very excited anyway talk to me about evil dead y'all and i will see you soon <laughs>